we can see the program for traffic light controller this traffic light interface we are going to interface this uh, traffic light uh, in interface with 8086 microprocessor this 8086 microprocessor is a 16 bit processor, processor and we are in need of traffic light interface with that and this is the algorithm we are uh, going to use the 80 uh, hexadecimal uh, content to AL register this 80 hexadecimal value is uh, 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 this is the uh, um, accumulator register and uh, we have to move the content okay and uh, we have to uh, initialize the port uh, by using this and out AL to control register now uh, move the lookup lookup table this is a lookup table and here we have uh, save the data okay from 1100 to 1113 1113 that is 18 uh, sorry totally 20 data we have saved 1100 to 1118 okay therefore we have saved some 20 data and uh, in the lookup table okay then uh, here now we are uh, going to move the uh, content of source index value to uh, AL register then we have to call delay this delay is used for you referring to the uh, traffic uh, road signal see here if uh, uh, if a car moves here then the other uh, sites okay this three sites car should ha should have to be in uh, in idle position see here there is no red light okay in road one okay then they they can move anywhere okay but here there is a in road two there is a red light and uh, road three red light and road uh, two is also red light okay therefore road one only free to move anywhere okay this is the principle that uh, we we can go okay then um, we have to uh, out output uh, uh, we have to initialize the port now okay this uh, output uh, this is uh, this is for initializing port and this is the output al to uh, port b register and uh, we have to call some delay because if if the car is moving from here others have to wait okay this is this delay is defined here and uh, now we can increment the source index and bx register move the content of uh, uh, destination uh, this, uh, move the content of 0015 hexadecimal value to uh, destination index register and we have to move the content of 0 FFF okay see here uh, the same data is uh, it's for repeating purpose we are using to the destination register and uh, this date then the data is declared to light the traffic light this is the data used in the lookup table now we can enter into the program and uh, we can uh, use the start okay use the stop start loop okay uh, first we have to uh, enter this lookup table address see lookup table address is 1100 to bx register and total count value we can uh, for a uh, it is uh, 10 for b 11 and for c 12 and uh, we have to move this 12 value to uh, c register then we have to move the value of 1102 accumulator and we have to initialize the port first and we have to increment the bx value that is this in this value in the lookup table okay now we have to uh, we have to enter move the incremented bx value to al and we have to uh, send send that value to out to zero that is port b register and we have to again increment and we have to move to accumulator and we have to set output value uh, to glow the port in uh, in uh, in port value 22 okay then we have to call delay we have to increment the bx register then uh, that this will move to the loop uh, we have to again and again increment the bx value and we have to uh, move this to al register and we have to make the light to glow okay therefore uh, after that for delay function we are uh, pushing this uh, cx value to on and um, this uh, uh, push operation operation 
the it will move the cx value to stack register and uh, now we are going to initialize 5 with that of a cx register and uh, we can uh, move dx uh, move the value of 0 fff to dx register okay then uh, we have to decrement again dx uh, this dx register c uh, dx register there is a 0 fff and until it becomes 0 we can repeat the loop 2 okay that is 0 fff 0 ffd 0 ffc like that we have to decrement until it reaches 0 then loop the repeated value okay again and again we have to repeat and pop cx we have to stop the cx and we have to return to the main program okay likewise the this program is uh, running and uh, now we can see the running of this uh, micro pro uh, microprocessor kit program okay see here uh, i am initializing the uh, microprocessor using a dot okay we have to type before that i have connected this traffic light interface uh, interface with the with the rs232 cable this is the rs232 cable which is connected with the traffic light uh, here we can see that all the lights are uh, glowing because it is initialized in first and uh, we have to start the microprocessor using a dot then uh, i have already uh, typed all the program because I, uh, we can view the program by u1000 okay u1000 um, uh, after entering that value we can move into the program which i already typed okay then we have to uh, uh, check the program whether I have taken all the typed all the data or not all the instructions correctly all the mnemonics rightly or not okay then uh, we have to click enter uh, for two times after entering each and every mnemonics because our code will be generated after that only it will move to the next line okay then uh, I am uh, uh, I am uh, just showing you the program which I have typed and uh, uh, for uh, main, uh, main thing is for looping function okay looping function we, we need not we couldn't put uh, like a start or a loop or delay we have to type only the address see here call delay function 101 f is the address of uh, delay function and therefore we have to type only the address value this address value should be made proper only uh, uh, made right proper only after we can write the opcode value uh, therefore we have to download the opcode sheet uh, from the internet or uh, we can see at the textbook of microprocessor and microcontroller uh, Gayankar book I think so and uh, also in the exam and all they will give you the opcode sheet from that opcode sheet only you have to write the opcode from the mnemonics you typed and uh, now uh, in loop calling also we have to type the program uh, address only ok we couldn't write the uh, value then jump on uh, jump to uh, that address only okay likewise i am uh, i am i have typed already the program and i am just showing you the program uh, program now uh, please uh, verify uh, here move dx fff okay so after that we have to decrement uh, dx until it becomes zero okay we are decrementing dx until it becomes 0 jump on 0 we have to give the uh, address of that uh, line ok where it should move now after completing all the programs I have to uh, type the program uh, last line that is written ok written this pop will uh, clear the stack value which I have already given then after that I have to uh, click next ok then uh, SB I am giving the input value of value in uh, value of lookup table in 1100 this 1100 I have to type all the datas uh, as in the lookup table that is uh, if uh, if i want to type the 16 datas 
then we have to give the data already i have typed here therefore i just show you the data which i have given okay i have shown you the data which i have uh, enter uh, the input data for lookup table now uh, click enter and uh, we have to start the program go uh, and uh, followed by the starting address of the program our starting address is 1000 okay and uh, we have to clearly uh, know the address starting address of our program we should not uh, uh we should we should not uh, uh extend the address of uh, lookup table and uh, program table see here after executing the program uh, this uh, light will glow as per uh, see uh, this red light uh, is glowing okay red light is glowing uh, in two sides and other side it is uh, in on condition we can also see in the green light also okay it is uh, on in only one side thank you students in this way only we have to collect connect the traffic light controller thank you students